Exercises to get rid of mucus in your chest. Our respiratory system has a built-in mechanism for keeping itself clean. It can be slowed down by pollution, smoking, and certain respiratory ailments, which leaves it open to bacterial and viral attack. When your system is compromised, you could have chest congestion, inflammation, shortness of breath, and lung infections. A liter or two of mucus is produced by the respiratory system each day in a healthy person. Our respiratory system gets dry and dysfunctional without this clear, viscous cleaner. However, excessive mucus can cause respiratory issues including bronchitis and pneumonia. Breathing becomes challenging as the airway tightens and obstructs. Additional mucus serves as a haven for bacteria and viruses. Hi friends, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll be talking about different exercises to help get rid of mucus in the chest. Stay tuned! Controlled coughing Coughing is your body's natural defense mechanism for pushing out mucus to clear your airways. However, excessive coughing might damage your lungs and respiratory system. Uncontrolled coughing causes airways to become irritated, which narrows them and traps mucus, which can then cause lung infection. In contrast, controlled coughing helps to keep your airways and lungs clear of mucus by liquefying it and moving it through them. Here is a quick tip to help you clear your airways of mucus. Place your feet on the floor and relax your shoulders as you sit in a chair. Inhale deeply through your nose while pressing the palms of your hands, fingers interlocked, firmly against your tummy. Cough twice or three times with your lips slightly open as you exhale. Then lean forward and softly press your hands into your stomach. Cough loudly, quickly, and sharply. Once more, take a slow, gentle inhale through your nose. Avoid mouth breathing or rapid breathing. If you don't, you risk preventing mucus from leaving the lungs. It may also result in uncontrollable coughing. Rest, then try again if required. Chest Percussion Chest percussion is a physical therapy technique aimed at loosening mucus and phlegm that may be trapped in your lungs and airways. Think of it as a rhythmic tapping or clapping motion performed on your chest and back. This technique helps to break up the mucus, making it easier for your body to clear it through coughing or other natural mechanisms. Now, you might be wondering how a little tapping can actually make a difference. Well, here's the science behind it. The rhythmic percussion motion creates vibrations that travel through your chest and back. These vibrations help to dislodge the mucus from the walls of your airways. Once the mucus is loosened, it's more likely to move up to your throat, making it easier for you to cough out. For the best results, cup your hand and slightly tap your chest and, if possible, your back. You may hear a loud sound, but you shouldn't feel any pain. Tap for a minute on each side, but avoiding your spine and breastbone. Draining Mucus from Your Lungs For those who practice Pilates, meditation, or yoga, this diaphragmic or belly breathing may be familiar. It can also aid in the removal of mucus when holding particular positions. This can be done on a bed or the floor, but pillows or cushions are required. Ensure that you are starving or haven't eaten in the previous two hours. Wait at least 20 to 30 minutes after using an inhaler. Put one hand on your stomach and the other on your chest to breathe diaphragmically. Push your belly out as far against your palm as you can while taking a slow, deep breath in through your nose. The hand on your stomach should move while the hand on your chest should not. You should be able to feel the hand on your stomach move in when you exhale. If you need to cough, sit up and do controlled coughing like we talked about earlier. Deep breathing Deep breathing isn't just about inhaling and exhaling air. It's about tapping into the full capacity of your lungs and making the most of each breath. It's a technique that involves taking slow, deliberate breaths, allowing oxygen to reach every nook and cranny of your lungs. When you take deep breaths, you're expanding your lung space, increasing oxygen exchange, and promoting better blood circulation. This helps break down mucus and clear those air passages. Find a comfortable spot to sit or lie down. Place one hand on your chest and the other on your abdomen. As you inhale, focus on letting your abdomen rise as you fill your lungs with air. Exhale slowly through your mouth, feeling your abdomen fall. Remember, it's all about the rhythm. Inhale for a count of four, hold for a count of four, and exhale for a count of six. This controlled breathing pattern helps open up your airways and aid in mucus clearance. 
Mucus in the lungs can be part of having certain health conditions and something that you'll need to learn how to manage. Regularly clearing mucus from your lungs is part of living with bronchiectasis and COPD. Controlled coughing, deep breathing, chest percussion, and alternative therapies help by reducing, loosening, and coughing up the mucus to prevent lung infections. It's important that you use mucus reducing strategies on a regular basis, not just when your symptoms act up. If you have been diagnosed with pulmonary disease, talk to your healthcare provider or respiratory therapist about the best approaches for managing mucus in your lungs. Remember, these exercises are meant to complement medical advice, not replace it. If you find that your symptoms persist or worsen, don't hesitate to seek professional help. Stay proactive about your health and keep those airways clear. If you found these exercises helpful, give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more health tips.